Hi guys, this is Small Q Partner. These are the Walgreens deals breakdown for the week of August 16th through August 22nd, 2020. And these are all digital and printable coupon deals. So let's get started. I want to note that the beauty event will take place August 20th through August 22nd, 2020. So it'll be a Thursday through a Saturday. And I will post beauty scenarios on August 19th, 2020, which is a Wednesday. So stay tuned and look out for that video. And I do have an ultimate scenario at the end of the video, so stay tuned for that. So if you are an intermediate or an advanced couponer and you have a lot of points on your account, and this is a scenario where you use a lot of points to pay on a spin deal, it's a low out of pocket and you're getting a ton of stuff. So stay tuned for this scenario. So I just want to note, be safe out there because COVID-19 is still out there and spreading. So be safe and stay safe. And if you want to do couponing online, coupons apply differently online. So if you have a percentage off or a dollar off booster coupon, they apply after IVCs and manufactured coupons online. But in store, it applies after IVCs, but before manufactured coupons. So if you have these types of booster coupons, unless it is an online exclusive, use them in store because it's a better deal if you use them in store. But it is okay to use the spin boosters online because the manufactured coupons do not affect those. And pass on any deals that give a register rewards back online, do them in store. But it is okay to do the deals that give points back online. So in the ad, they advertise this as an online exclusive coupon. So it's 20% 20, 20 off regular price items online. And the promo code is SAVE with all capital letters. And, it, and I did try this out. It does work, but it applies after manufactured coupons online. So it's better than, you know, no savings, especially if you are doing those online order and then you're picking it up at the store. It's better to get a little savings than no savings at all. And just a reminder, every Sunday, make sure that you clip your manufactured digital coupons and only clip the high value coupons of similar items because if you have all of them clipped, you either have to buy all of those items so you get all of the coupons off or, you know, it will take only the lowest value coupon off. So make sure that you are selective and clip the high value coupons only. And check Saving Star for new offers. And if you receive any good new digital coupons or even rebates, I will make an updated deals video and it will be linked and pinned in the comments below. So if you are not subscribed, just check back on this video. Sunday evening or Monday will be the latest. Um, I will pin it in the comments if you are not subscribed, just check back. But if you are subscribed, you will receive a notification every time I upload a new video. And that is only if we receive good new digital coupons that are not mentioned in this video. And weekly ads differ from region to region, but recently it has been similar from region to region. So I'm not sure how long this is going to last. And store pricing may vary from store to store. And this is a booster for everyone. So I'm assuming that everyone got the digital version because this is a flyer or weekly ad uh, coupon. So it cannot be stacked. So if you have the flyer version, I know a lot of stores, they are not printing the weekly ad because at my store, they only have like copies of like one page of some of the, some of the deals. So I'm not sure if you can get this coupon, but I do have a digital version. And if you have a digital version, make sure to use the digital version. And this booster coupon is valid from August 9th through August 22nd. And if you have both of these, you cannot stack them. You can only use one Either or, basically, one or the other. And what is the what is ten times every day points? So every day points you get ten points per dollar. So ten times every day points only when you spend twenty dollars or more is one hundred points per dollar. So if you spend less than twenty dollars, you only you're only going to get that ten points per dollar. So you have to spend twenty dollars or more in order to get that one hundred points per dollar. And ten times every day points when you spend twenty, it's equivalent to two thousand points or equivalent to two dollars. So like if you spend forty, then you'll get 4,000 points and it'll be equivalent to $4 and so forth. So I have a 25% um, of regular price from my order pickup. So if you do free ship to store and order pickup, you will receive a 25% of regular price item coupon on the bottom of your email. And 
in the fine print, it says screenshots are not allowed. So you must show them the email or, you know, print it out. So that's why I did not screenshot it here because I don't want anybody to get in trouble. So if you have it, you can use it multiple times. I did try it out. You can use it multiple times until it expires. I think it expires on August 31st from the ones that I have. And this is considered an IVC if you want to use this 25% off regular price items on spend deals. So make sure that you subtract the 25% off. And after the 25% off, it must meet your spend threshold in order to get all of your points back. And I want to know if you have a Catalina, which is a paper spin booster, which is it prints from the Catalina um, machine. Those, you can only use one and you can stack it with a digital booster. So you can only use one paper booster. But digital boosters, you can use more than one. And it will stack. But you can only use one paper booster to get extra points back. And if you have a Catalina paper spin booster, you cannot use points as a partial payment because the system will not allow you to do it. You can only use points as a partial payment if it is a digital spin booster or a Walgreens flyer or paper beauty booster. And I will not be going over this, but I do have a video link in the description box below. And I do have each of these bullet points explained with examples at the beginning of the video in that, you know, linked in the description box below if you're interested. So this will be a good video to watch if you are a beginner and you want to know all the rules of, the, of spin deals. Same goes with buy deals. I do have the video link in the description box below. So make sure to check that video out and you only need to watch the beginning of the video. And let's get started with all of the deals. Household deals. So the Arm & Hammer, they are buy one, get two free. So one of these, they are $6.99. So basically, you're going to pay for one of them and you get the other two free. So it'll be three for $6.99. You will use a $1 off digital if you still have them on your account. I did redeem one of those, but I still have those printables. Or a printable from coupons.com, I, I think it's still available. You can only use one here because Walgreens does not take coupons for the free item. You can try it and see if they accept it, but as far as I know, they don't take it for the free items at my store. So you'll pay $5.99 for three of them or about $2 each. And if you're doing this deal alone, you can use your points to pay for this. So I would check for game digitals on the 16th because this is a pretty good deal. So when you buy three of these game products, it'll be $4.99 each and then you get one free. So again, you can use coupons for the three of them, but not the free item. And the Scott, if you get the Scott Comfort Plus, they are $5 and we have a $1.25 off IVC. So IVCs, they are instant value coupons. So instant savings value coupons. Basically, um, they are Walgreens store coupons and they are in the monthly savings booklet. So these booklets, they are located at the front of the store near the weekly apps. So make sure to, uh, you know, grab one of these before you um, shop. And you, sh you could go to the index and find Scott and go to that page and you only need the cashier to scan it once. And there's also a 50 cents off Scott Comfort Plus printable from scottbrand.com. I did check recently and also check for manufactured digitals on the 16th because sometimes we do receive digitals for paper products. So you'll pay $3.25 and you can use your points to pay for this. And I want to know for the IVC, if you want to get more than once, more than one of these products, you, you only need the cashier to scan the barcode once and it'll take off $1.25 off for each one. That's only for IVCs, not manufactured coupons. And this is the complete home paper towels or bath, or bath tissues. These are $3.49. If you have this 50 cents off digital, you'll pay $2.99 and you can use your points to pay for this if you are doing this deal alone. So I think this is like an IVC because this is not a manufactured coupon because I did read the fine print and it doesn't say like it's a manufactured coupon. So if you are using this on a spin deal, make sure that you subtract 50 cents from your total and your total after IVC must meet your spin threshold because I think this is like an IVC. And the five star uh, products, these are BOGO free. So we do have saving star rebates. It's a dollar and 25 cents back on two, a dollar and 25 cents back on two, check out 51 rebate. It's, it's a limit of two and a dollar on two. I bought a rebate and my referral code is BPCFRDP. It's also in the description box below.
So I want to note that Saving Star and Checkout 51, they are the same company. So if you sign up using the same email address, you're only going to get one of the rebates. And if you only get one of the rebates, make sure that you use Checkout 51 because that is a limit of two. So you can get like more than two or like multiples of two and two times. So you, the max will be four of them. Um, for Saving Star, you, if you sign up using different email addresses for Saving Star and Checkout 51, you may get both of the rebates because, you know, it's like different. But um, if you sign up using the same email address, then you're only going to get one. As far as I know, I have two different email addresses when I sign up for these and I get both of the rebates. So that's why your mileage may vary. And these are some good filler items or even just cheap items if you just wanted to get them. So the Crayola, they are 99 cents. The Elmer's Lou and these various um, pens, Sharpies, and scissors, they are 49 cents. These dividers, um, the math tools, these are 79 cents. The Complete Home Tissues and a Dawn, 99 cents. And we do have a flyer coupon. We're, all, we're also going to get a digital version of this. So for the paper plates and the aluminum foil, they are going to be 99 cents. It's a limit of four. But in New Mexico, there's I think there are no limits. And then this is the best filler item because these um, highlighters and folders, they are five for a dollar. So you only need to get one and they are 29 cents each if you just want to get one and use it as a filler item for your register rewards. In the backpacks, they are five dollars. So I think this is a good price, and and I think during the tax free week, you don't pay taxes for the backpacks, as far as I know for Merlin, that is. And these are the Walgreens batteries. They are Bogo free. Food deals. So the Pringles, they are four for five dollars, and we are receiving a one dollar off for digital on the sixteenth. So you pay four dollars, and you can use your points to pay for this. If you know, if you want to do this deal alone, and there is a twenty-five cent I bought a rebate for the Pringles, and my referral code again is VPCFRDP. It's a limit of five, so you get a dollar back for buying four of them, making these three dollars for four or seventy-five cents each. So the combos they are two for four dollars, and we are receiving a two off two digital. You'll pay two dollars for two or a dollar each, and you can use your points to pay for this if you are doing this deal alone. I want to note, last time they advertised this, we only got a one-off two. So I think they lied on the last one. I hope we're getting a two-off two this time. So I will be focusing on the Skinny Pop. These are two for $6. And you will use a $1 off digital and a $1 off printable from coupons.com. It is no longer available, but if you held on to that coupon, it was from the 12th to the 18th. If you held on to that coupon, it has not expired yet. So you'll pay $4 for two or $2 each. And you can use your points to pay for this if you are doing this deal alone. So the Post or Quaker cereal, they are $1.99. And these are for select varieties. So we do have a 50 cents off Post cereal digital. So make sure to check to see if these are included. So you'll buy one of these for $1.99 and you will use this 50 cents off digital. So it is for select flavors. So make sure to check to see if they are included in a sale. If they are, then you'll pay $1.49 and you can use your points to pay for this if you are doing this deal alone. So the Nabisco, they are two for $5. I think it's only for the Oreo crackers this time, or Oreo cookies. And you, you will use the 75 cents off two digital, pay $4.25, and you can use your points to pay for this if you are doing this deal alone. And there is a 75 cent back on Nabisco on checkout 51. It's a limit of five. So you get a dollar and 50 cents back for two. And there's also an, a 75 cent saving star rebate for the Nabisco. So the reason I put your mileage may vary is because for saving star and checkout 51, they are the same company. So if you sign up using the same email address, you're only going to get one of the rebates. So if you're only going to get one of the rebates, I recommend to do checkout 51 because it's a limit of five. So you get a dollar and 50 cents back for two as opposed to only 75 cents back. But if you are able to get both of the rebates, because if you sign up using different email addresses, then it'll make these $2 for two or a dollar each. Even without the Saving Star rebate, I think it's still a pretty good deal. So the Chobani Greek Yogurt, 
you'll buy five of these for five dollars you can pay the five dollars for points if you are doing this deal alone there is a 25 cent i bought a rebate for the chobani greek yogurt and it's a limit of five and again my referral code is vpcfrdp it's also in the description box below if you're interested so you get a dollar and 25 cents back for buying five of them making these 375 for five or 75 cents each so the, the Godiva Masterpieces, these are included in the two for five sale. So you buy two of these for $5 and you can use your points to pay for this if you're doing this deal alone. There is a $1 I bought a rebate for the Godiva Masterpieces chocolate bars and it's a limit of five. And again, my referral code is VPCFRDP. So you get $2 back for buying two of them, making these $3 for two or $1.50 each. So these are some cheap deals. You don't need any coupons. So the breakfast, lunch, dinner, or whenever. So you have these condiments for, for BOGO free, the ground beef for $2.99, the DiGiorno pieces, two for $10, the Campbell soup, two for $2, and the Star Kiss, they are 99 cents. I think the Star Kiss could be a good filler item if you don't want like Arizona iced teas or candies. I think it's a healthier option, I guess. And the snacks, this is a coupon from the ad, and we're getting a digital version of this. So it's 99 cents for theater candies. And it's a there's it's a limit of six, but no limits in New Mexico. And these are some beverage deals. So the Folgers, if you get the 10.3 to 11.3 ounces, the regular ones, they are $2.99 with card. And decaf will be $3.99 with card. And the Arizona iced tea is two for a dollar. Again, this is a good filler item. Personal care deals. So I will be saving the beauty deals for the beauty events so that, you know, it'll be a better deal, you know, to get it during the beauty event because we're getting a ton of points back. And again, the beauty event is from August 20th through August 22nd, which is a Thursday through Sunday. And then beauty scenarios will be posted on August 19th, which is a Wednesday. So stay tuned and look out for that video. So this deal is all month long. So I, I, you know, I want to include different deals with the, with these coupons because I think we did receive these coupons a while ago. So if you still have them on your account and you don't know what to do with them, this is a good opportunity to use them. So these are buy to get 5,000 points and they, they last all month long. It ends on August 29th. So what you can do is if you still have this 3 of 2 digital on your account, you can buy two of these Oral-B gum care. They are $4.99 each. You'll buy two of these for $9.98. Use the 25% off regular price from your order pickup email. So it'll take off $2.50 and your new total will be $7.48. You will use the 3 of 2 digital, pay $4.48, and you can use your points to pay for this if you are doing this deal alone because this is a buy deal. You'll get back 5,000 points, making these free in a 52 cent money maker so or you can do it this way if you have already used your three off two so we do have a one dollar off oral b toothbrush and a two dollar off one oral b toothbrush and this one is for select varieties but it is attaching to the oral b gum care so if you add both of these up it will be the same value as a three off two so it'll be the same items, the same 25% off regular price, and the same new total. But the digitals will be a dollar off and a two dollar off. You'll pay $4.48 and you can use your points to pay for this if you are doing this deal alone because this is a buy deal. Get back 5,000 points, making these free in a 52 cent money maker. Or you can buy four of these if you still have all of these digitals and it'll be $19.96, 25% off regular price will be $4.99 off, new total will be $14.97. You will use the $1 off digital, $2 off digital, and a three off two digital. Your total coupons will be $6. You'll pay $8.97 and you can use your points to pay for this. Get back 10,000 points because for every two that you buy, you get 5,000 points. So that's why it's 10,000 points because you bought four of them making these free in a dollar and three cent money maker. So this is a different deal from the buy to get 5,000 points because for this deal, you're getting a register rewards back and you have to buy three of them. So make sure to check the tags at your store. So these are $3.99. So anything that's on sale for $3.99 is most likely included in this sale, but still check before you purchase the item. 
And when you buy three, you get a $5 register reward. So if I buy three of these for $11.97, you will use the 503 digital that will be available on the 16th. You'll pay $6.97 and you can use your points to pay for this if you're doing this deal alone because this is a buy deal. Get back $5 register reward, making these $1.97 for three of them or $0.66 cents each. So the Colgate, these are for the toothpaste or the toothbrushes. They are $2.99, and when you buy two, you get 2,000 points. So if I buy two of these for $5.98, we are receiving a four off two digital that will be available on the 16th. So you'll pay $1.98, and you can use your points to pay for this if you are doing this deal alone. Because this is a buy deal, get back 2,000 points, making these free. Or you can include it in a scenario. So you can buy four of the Oral-B gum care for $19.96 and three of the Arm & Hammer for $6.99. Total comes to $26.95. So if you use the 25% off regular price items from your order pickup email, it'll take off $4.99 for, from the Oral-B only because the Arm & Hammer is technically on sale. So it will take off $4.99 from the Oral-B only and your new total will be $21.96. You will use the 10 times everyday points when you spend $20 or more, $1 off Oral B, $2 off Oral B, 3 off 2 Crescent Oral B, and $1 off Arm & Hammer. Your total coupons will be $7. You'll pay $14.96 and you must pay your register rewards or cash because this is a spin deal once you use the spin booster. You'll get back 10,000 points from the Oral B and 2,100 points from the booster, making these $2.96 for 7 items or $0.42 cents each. Or you can combine these two deals together and get four Oral B gum care for $19.96 and two Colgate for $5.98. Total comes to $25.94. And again, you will use the 25% off regular price items from your order pickup. And it'll take off $4.99 from the Oral B only because the Colgate is on sale. So your new total is $20.95. You will use the 10 times everyday points when you spend $20 or more. $1 off Oral B, $2 off Oral B, 3 off 2 Crestle Oral B, 4 off 2 Colgate. And your total coupons will be $10. You'll pay $10.95 and you must pay for register rewards or cash. Get back 10,000 points from the Oral B, 2,000 points from the Colgate, and 2,000 points from the Booster. Making these free and a three dollar and five cent money maker so the less serene they are spin 10 get a get five thousand points so what you can do is buy two of the ready tabs the eight count for $2.99 each two of them will be $5.98 and one of the mouthwash 500 mils for $4.19 total comes to $10.17 you will use that one dollar off digital you'll pay $9.17 you must pay register rewards or cash because this is a spin deal if you are doing this deal alone get back 5,000 points from the deal and you will submit your receipt to the link that I will link in the description box below for the two ready tabs so when you buy two ready tabs you will get a five dollar virtual visa card and i will link that link in the description box below so it'll make these free and an 83 cent money maker after you receive the virtual visa card and what i do with my virtual visa card is go on amazon.com and buy an amazon gift card of the same value with this virtual visa card that's how i use my virtual visa card so the Schick or Skintimate Disposables, these are $5.99 and we are receiving a $3 off digital and you'll pay $2.99 and you can use your points to pay for this if you're doing this deal alone. And the Schick Edge or Skintimate Shade Cream or Gel, these are $2.99 and you will use that $1 off digital that we will be receiving on the 16th and you'll pay $1.99 and you can use your points to pay for this if you're doing this deal alone. And this is another scenario. So what you can do is buy two of the ready tabs, the eight count for $5.98, one of the mouthwash, the 500 mils for $4.19, two Colgate for $5.98, one Schick Edge or Skin Timid Shave Cream or Gel for $2.99, and two Arizona Iced Teas for a dollar. Total comes to $2014. So you will use the 10 times everyday points when you spend $20 or more, $1 off Lesterine, four off two Colgate, and $1 off Schick Edge or Skin Timid Shave gel or cream. 
your total coupons will be $6. You'll pay $14.14 and you must pay with register rewards or cash. And if you are paying with register rewards, you can pay with two of them because the two Arizona ICs, they are technically two um, filler items that don't have coupons attaching to them. And even the ready tabs, you can actually use like four of them because the ready tabs don't have coupons attaching to them. So you'll get back 5,000 points from the Lesterine, 2,000 points from the Colgate, and 2,000 points from the Booster. And you will submit your receipt to get your $5 virtual Visa card for the two ready tabs. And it will make these 14 cents for 8 items or 2 cents each. Health Deals So this is no coupons needed, so it's buy one get two free of these reading glasses. Baby Deals so I will be focusing on the pull-ups. So these are two for $18, and when you spend $25, you get a $5 register reward. So what you can do is buy three of the pull-ups for $27, use the 10 times everyday points when you spend $20 or more, and three of the $2 off pull-ups printables from scottbrand.com. So you can print two per account, so if you make another account, you can print one more. Total coupons will be $6. You'll pay $21, and you can pay with register rewards or cash because once you use the spin booster, it becomes a spin deal. If you are not using the spin booster, you can pay with points because if you if this is a spin deal and you're getting a register rewards back you can pay with points and then you can still get that register rewards back if you know what i mean but since you are using the booster then you must pay with register rewards or cash and you'll get back five dollar five dollar register reward from the deal and two thousand and seven hundred points from the booster and there is a one dollar i bought a rebate for the pull-ups it's a limit of five and again my referral code is vpc frdp so you get three dollars back for buying three of them making these eleven dollars for three or three dollars and sixty seven cents each and make sure to also check for new manufactured digital coupons on the 16th because sometimes we do receive them this is these are some miscellaneous deals so this is a gift card deal so the american express visa or my vanilla prepaid cards these are i think you buy one and you get five thousand points so um if you buy one of those twenty dollar values and you get five thousand points i think that's a decent deal it's better than getting nothing back and this is another gift card deal. So if you buy two of these, you get $10 Walgreens gift card. So the cheapest ones are like $15 value. So if you buy two of them, it'll be like $30 and you get a $10 Walgreens gift card back. And so this is the ultimate scenario. You'll buy two of the combos for $4, two of the Colgate toothbrush for $5.98, three of the Colgate toothpaste for $8.97, one of the Schick disposable for $5.99, one of the Schick edge or skin to mint shave gel or cream for $2.99, and three of the Crest or Oral B for $11.97. Total comes to $30.90. I mean $39.90. You will use the 10 times everyday points when you spend $20 or more, so it must be $20 after IVCs. So none of these deals have IVC, so it's, you know, $20 after IVCs already. Um, $2 off two combos, 4 off two Colgate, 5 off three Colgate. So we did receive two 5 off three. One is expired, and the this other one, it doesn't expire until later on. So if you have not already used it, then you can use it this week. $3 off Schick Disposables, $1 off Schick Edge or Skintiment Shave Cream or Shave Gel, and 5 off 3 Crest or Earl B. Total coupons will be $20. So your total coupons already cover for that 10 times every day points when you spend $20 or more. So your total is $19.90 because it's $39.90 minus the $20 in manufactured coupons. So where I am, they do cover the, the points do cover the taxes. So Merlin tax is 6% of that $39.90. So it's $239 Merlin tax. So it's $22.29. And I can pay with 20,000 points and I pay the $229 out of pocket. So if your state does not have sales tax or if the points does not cover the taxes, then you have to add a filler item such as a highlighter or a folder for 29 cents and get your total up to $20 or more so that you can redeem 20,000 points. So before I move on, I want to go over this spin total. So what counts for spin total is manufactured coupons, register rewards because they are manufactured coupons and cash out of pocket.
So since you are only using that 10 times every day points when you spend $20 or more booster, you only need to spend $20 or more in order to get, you know, your points from your booster. So your manufacturer coupons alone is $20. So if you don't want any more points, only the 22,000 points from the $20 um, threshold for your everyday, 10 times everyday points, then you can pay the rest of it with points. So you have $20 in manufacturer coupons and that alone cover for that booster if you just want the 2,000 points from the booster. Assuming you have no registered rewards and you pay the whole balance down with points. You pay the whole 1990 with 20,000 points. So that's zero dollars cash that you paid out of pocket. So your spend total is met just by paying $20 in manufactured coupons. So you'll get back $11 in registered rewards and points, 2,000 points from the booster because your spend total is $20, 4,000 points from the Colgate, and $5 registered reward from the Crest or Earl B. Your final cost is $8.90 for 12 items or $0.74 cents each. How I calculate the final cost is the $19.90 and getting back $11 in registered rewards and points. So $19.90 minus $11 is $8.90. I count my points and register rewards as cash because I did have to earn those by using, you know, by paying out of pocket in order to earn those. So those are actually, you know, I consider cash out of pocket. So I don't consider this transaction free. That's why I calculated that way because those points that I earn and those register rewards that I earn are actually cash out of pocket. I count them as cash. And that is it for me. Thanks for watching. Bye.